I can see it now. I can see it now, but because he's there, I was never looking up there. So, what I need to do is this, I think. think to do this. I should have as well. There's a lot of climbing in this. I would never have thought it was there. So it is probably my fault. It's a friend we talked for. Through here. Through here. Try and spin it round a bit. There we go. Well done. That's all the batteries in place. Now we can transmit energy to this projector, get it online. Ah, the wicks. Let me turn it on so you can move that debris. Very cool into you to solve these puzzles now. So that was happening. I'm sure I solved one of them. Maybe I didn't see that after I solved one. I definitely solved this one. Oh, that one doesn't have to go there. Hey, right, this one needs a hundred. Do it that way, 150 is too much. from there. We need it to be a hundred. So there's thirty. Twenty-five, which is fifty-five. And ninety. Seventy-five. Fifty. Oh wait, that was it. We did it. That button would kill you, Robin. What button? Turning turning off gravity. Where's it? This one. <laughs> the journey will begin shortly. Please take your seats. I really want you to take my, my seat. What about that button? Who am I going to look after now? <laughs> right, we've only shut down gravity. Where are we? How far back did he take me? Just Let to me when you switched on. Solve this one. What do you mean? 
Why did you not? Where were you? Where were you? I was stuck. Right, so we got all that on. No, we didn't. Damn it. Right, we'll do this again. Right, that button would kill me. So we're not gonna the do that. The journey will begin shortly. Please take your seats. Right, the journey will begin shortly. The journey will begin shortly. Please take your seats. But you said there was going to be a way to move some of this debris. Thanks. What were you talking about? This. The journey will begin shortly. Please take Your your seats. You're quite the naturalist. That's right, Higgs. Like, what are you doing? Why are we still in this place? I wish I had a good answer for you, Anka. The journey will begin shortly. Please so, take your seats. So it keeps telling me. So we need to go back to the area we were in. Oh, right, that made me feel old. I need to do that. Why is that happening? <laughs> right, there we go. The journey will begin shortly. Please take your seats. The journey will begin shortly. Please take your seats. Nice. Right, one we'll go see about the journey. Apparently it's about to begin shortly. We should uh, take our seats. Isn't that right? The journey will begin shortly. Please take your seats. See? Hope this is where we take your seats for the journey. The journey will begin shortly. Please take your seats. That'll take a while to process. Wow. The journey must be beginning. Have you seen this before? No. Please welcome your VIP guest for tonight, Robin Anderson. Light. Light from the void. The voyage of humanity has been long, but we move forward ever faster, ever further. We reach into the darkness and bring light. We send out our brightest and most brilliant to new stars, new planets, to Tyson III aboard the starship Esmeralda. 3,000 souls growing with each generation Children born among the stars to be as gods. Where there is darkness, they will bring light. Where there is chaos, they will bring order. And where it is barren, they will bring life. 
Humanity's greatest journey yet will end here, at Tyson III, one century from now. But this is just the beginning. Our children will come together, work together, be together, and build a new world. Where one journey ends, humanity's next journey begins. A story that will be as incredible as any yet told on Earth. We will build a new world out there. We will bring life to every corner of the universe. And we will be magnificent. If only we could have built this. Amazing. Believe me, Higgs. I'm going to build that city. I've got a lot of time on my hands anyway. Ah. Don't worry, Robin. I have a plan. Do you? Why can I get in here? Oh my god. That wasn't my plan, exactly. Uh, Let me think. What's the only thing that will scare oh. a Tyrannosaur? A meteor? Wait! Another Tyrannosaur! Scan Lyca, now! Call the Lyca? Of course. I'll run her scan through the projector. It'll buy us some time. Now let's go. I think I found a way out. Over here. <laughs> Robin. No, this is amazing. If anyway, anyway, go, Hanks. Oh, look after now. That was amazing. Scan her now, Robin. So now let's go. I think I found a way out. Where? Better Over here. here. Oh, it's shot. Come on, let me help you. Help me where? What? We solve a puzzle with that time. distract him forever. If only we had a meteor, the projector. If I disable the levitation, that could work. It's going to fall! Clear the impact zone! Oh. Let me do a quick scan and make sure he's dead. He might just be pretending. Okay. Phew. That's a relief. He is most definitely deceased. Quite incredible what can be achieved when we put aside our little differences. Yeah. Thanks, Higgs. You know, they killed Lyca's entire family. And now it looks like they are coming for her. Lyca must pose a serious threat. If she's some kind of alpha predator, that could make her very useful if tamed. And very dangerous, if not. So, you'd better make sure you train her properly then. If she's going to be a member of our little family. What about the projector? Oh yes, the projector. Let's get this started. Here we go. As your commander, I beg you to stand down. I won't release your ship. You launch it! Oh god, no. Some of the crew tried to force launch an Escala shuttle. The explosion knocked the Esmeralda out of stable orbit. Ready the escape pods! The pods were disabled, sealed shut. Someone locked them down. Why would anyone disable the escape pods? Is anyone even in them? Launch the pods manually. Do it, now! She was forced to launch every pod. Maybe only one will survive, but that is better than nothing. Launch! The crew didn't make it. They're empty. All empty. Oh, wait. There are people on that one. And more. 
More people escaped. I don't believe it. Look at them. Falling like rain. We didn't see all the parks. It's impossible to know how many launched, but some did make it off the Esmeralda. Maybe even your parents. Of course, we don't know if they survived on the planet. I just hope they had a Higgs unit like me with them. Yes, and a pet dinosaur. Everyone needs a pet dinosaur. That's right, Higgs. Let's go home, everyone. No, oh, getting trophies. Oh no, was that it? Damn it! That was an amazing finale, though. Like the big enormous T-Rex fighting a holographic tiny T-Rex. That was really good though. Dinosaurs. So that, that last puzzle I was stuck on was sort of like the last boss. <laughs> if the last boss was looking for a sort of wedge at a window where you were given a jump scare. But it is really good. If you've if you've got PlayStation VR I'd say this one has a lot of really nice moments. And it might be the first full game feeling one. Like lengthy story based game that I've played in VR. I've got to say it was really good. Dinosaurs. Exploration. There to go. Climbing. <laughs> Pet T-Rex, I mean gets a lot of bonus marks for that. Hopefully that soundtrack here that I'm ruining by talking over it. Just take this forward a bit. So we'll try and jump in on the app and see if there's anybody there. It has, it's got me really excited for a lot of things. 
very excited for Resident Evil 7. I think playing it might be quite similar to that. But dinosaurs. Dinosaurs were amazing. Richard Mellon. Okay, for the uh, Time Crisis 1. <laughs> you never know. Soundtrack is really lovely, actually. The big T-Rex showing up at the end was really nice. It was a bit of sort of the original Jurassic Park feel to it. Where the T-Rex comes in and gets rid of the raptors. But using the projection of uh, of your wee pet T-Rex was really cool. It was a nice... Uh, Nice way to finish the game off. Dropping the big thing on the T-Rex, man, that was very, very cool. I think that took about seven or eight hours. You could probably do it a lot quicker, depending on how stuck you get at some bits. But it's pretty enjoyable. And a lot of people worked on it.
credits VR. Yeah. Alphabetical credits. Yeah. Richard Miller. Has this already been through? Credits are quite long. A lot of people worked on it. That's a lot of names starting with A. It's very worrying. Oh, I like that piece of music. Very nice. And Sophia.
here we go. Robinson the Journey. Updating Amphitarium. <laughs> Must have just missed a couple of creatures. Oh, got another trophy there. Wonder if there's a wee bit. Final closing. After credits message, maybe. Hey, Higgs. Hey, Laika. What's happening? To just set us free to roam about now? It does. There's a missing Higgs unit there, apparently. But aye, it looks like that's it. Thanks for tuning in everybody, and I hope we see you again very, very soon. Well, that was Robinson the Journey. Bye. Bye.